Excitement enveloping everyone here because it is a huge occasion. The Champions League final. Who's going to be crowned Club Kings of Europe? It's Barcelona. They face Liverpool and it's coming up. And here it is, the last lap in the season-long race for the trophy. Millions of viewers from around the world are tuning in for the biggest final in club football, the Champions League final. A warm welcome from Lee Derek Ray, joined here in the commentary box, as always, by the former Arsenal and West Ham player, Stuart Robson. It's Barcelona taking on Liverpool. Well, what a night there. Two great teams, a perfect pitch, a magnificent stadium, and millions watching around the world. What more could you ask for, apart from maybe different commentators? we think for Barcelona Marc-André Ter Stegen in goal Frenkie de Jong plays alongside Ilkay Gundogan in centre midfield and the starting role on attack today is handed to Robert Lewandowski and this is how Liverpool will line up Alisson begins in goal Trent Alexander-Arnold starts with Andrew Robertson in the wide defensive areas and they line up with just the one striker looking to do a bit of damage Alisson So Bosloy Succeeded in keeping it in play Going to win it back Robert Lewandowski is one of those natural finishers and could be a big part of the story today, Stuart. Well, Derek, he's the perfect finisher. He's got a great shot at him, his movement is excellent, and in 1v1 situations, you always expect him to score. Cleared away comprehensively. Virgil van Dijk. McAllister. He has teammates around him. Not possibly a yellow card as the flow was stopped. A free kick and the keeper took it cleanly. And defensive play to be applauded. Luis Diaz. Diaz. Another cross that will live long in the memory. Goal kick. Kunde. Gundogan. Conate. Trent Alexander-Arnold. A well, very effective play in possession. And they forge ahead. And still danger here. And it goes! And the second time of asking. And the keeper feels hung out to dry. And it's a really poor challenge. Uh, what's the referee going to do about it? Lewandowski. Well, that takes the wind out of their sails. Great defending. And Liverpool might be able to cash in. He's in behind. Oh, a save right out of the top drawer. Super stop. Went in strongly, decisively. Now, who can he play it to? says play on advantage Liverpool can he finish here and keeping it out
played over. Keeper getting the touch. Felix. Here it is again, and it's all about the pace and transition. They're so quick to get out from the back, and a really powerful strike from João Felix. Great technique, that's a top class goal. So underway again, following the goal that made things level. So Bosnoy. A tiny ball. Diaz. That's a nice looking ball in terms of the shot but not to be Romeo now with De Jong and he read it superbly Diaz well the cross didn't get past the first defender and it could be a chance for Liverpool to take the lead from a corner. And short it is. Angle for Salah. This looks more than decent. Oh, there it is! There's the goal that gives them the lead. Just what they wanted. So back underway at 2-1. Tight contest here. is McAllister a danger here as he runs at them long way at this well the shot seemed like a good option but goalkeeper's ball Christensen Oriol Romeo if you're wondering about stoppage time one minute to be added on And with that, the first half comes to an end. And the second half underway. Liverpool looking to build upon a largely positive first half showing. Salah does thrive on veering in field. Real chance! You've just witnessed a moment of truly high... Big. You're absolutely right. What a save that is. He's reacted so quickly. Well, he made sure there was absolutely no way through. Now, this could be productive. Diaz. To stay him with a great save. Robertson. In towards Salah. No damage done. Well, they certainly haven't been at their best today. But that save by Ter Stegen might just be the turning point. Well, maybe a chance for them now to relieve the pressure by swinging a few passes together. Oh, to level the match. And a goal here. The keeper unable to prevent it. Barcelona on level. Well, let's see this again. The vision to play this through ball is superb, and when he gets onto it, he decides to go for power. It's a really impressive finish. It gives the ball back no chance. Individual brilliance. And 
tidy in possession from Barcelona. Not a fantastic piece of defending, was it? But a good piece of tidying up. Chance maybe to use their counter-attacking ability to good effect. So Bosloy. It's a perfect challenge. Big chance. And a goal this time. Applying the finishing touch. Just what the doctor ordered. Well, here it is again. And the pace in which they break forward is devastating. It's so hard to defend against. And Lewandowski's finish was excellent. At times he's run and finds that bit of space and he was never going to miss that. And the ball is moving again. 3-2. Van Dijk. Now with Konate. The referee has let the advantage accrue to Liverpool. Perfectly positioned to take it away. And now the visionary, Lewandowski. Well, just watch this again. Lewandowski's pass is inch perfect. And then through on goal, he just goes for power and smashes it past the keeper. There's no stopping that. What a great finish. So the current scoreline, 4-2. Salah. And making considerable progress with the ball. Will he play it in? An alert piece of defending. The shot looked promising, but the keeper had the measure of it. 20 minutes to go in this one. And on the back of that particular challenge, will the referee let the matter rest there? This attack looks highly promising. Determined defending. Corner awarded to Liverpool. Well, they've been getting the substitute ready, and now they will make the personnel change. Short corner taken. Delivery from Salah here. Oh, that's top-notch goalkeeping, you've got to say. Now we're inside the final quarter of an hour now. It's a fine piece of attacking play from Lewandowski. And he has teammates to give it to. But it fizzles out thanks to that piece of defending. Well, he has the measure of his opponent. Who's going to win this joust? Still could be dangerous. And problem solved for now. Could be a chance to break here. Beyond. All hands on deck. Superb defensive judgment to end the attack. Frankie de Jong. Pedri. Jules Koundé on the ball. Gundogan. Felix, well read to ease the pressure. Well, and the dying embers of the game, and Barcelona all powerful in this one, Stuart. Well, they've been much the better side up to now. Some of their approach play has been excellent. They just need to control possession for these final few minutes to cap off a really good display. And the counter attack is on, options available. Leading it through, could be a chance. And a decent save, full credit. And a double substitution it's going to be. So the corner played into the box. Goalkeeper's ball, it was always going to be that way. Really 
getting stuck in. Now options are plenty. The referee has decided that two additional minutes are in order. Let's fly here. Well, the keeper is happy. The bar was there. Well, they can keep possession of it now. Luis Diaz. And now the wait is over. Barcelona have done it. The Champions League trophy will return to Catalonia. Well, just look at the emotions out there. Joy and relief on one side, despair and heartache on the other. But we've got the right winners here. They fully deserved it on the night. For these players, well, it's the night of their lives. And they're determined to enjoy every millisecond. Well, they have to make the most of this, don't they? It's a great thing. What an achievement for them. Well, they don't need to be reminded about what comes next. It's the presentation of the coveted Champions League trophy. Well, there's some tired players out there, but what you can be sure of, they'll find some energy when they get their hands on the trophy. They'll be going mad in the next few moments. It's Barcelona's Champions League. Well, this is what they wanted. What a moment for these players. They've worked so hard to win this trophy. They've been fantastic. And you can feel the emotion. It's natural to reflect on this final, but so much hard work has gone into the entire campaign. Memories, memories. And that's exactly what they're doing. Trotting up.